Tom DeVecchio, your weather authority. It was chilly and wet for the weekend. At least today we're getting some sunshine and a touch milder. Here's the physical therapy and balance centers weather cam. And uh, this one, of course, from our tower looking north here. Familiar site, Peach and I-90 there. And, of course, the lake out in the distance. Lake effect clouds still hanging tough overhead. Uh, but uh, the sun gradually getting a little more traction and that should be the case into the afternoon some sunshine but boy still a chilly breeze going outside make sure you dress warmly those warm temperatures are gone now nice weather expected for tomorrow and actually temperatures will moderate uh, beginning tomorrow and into wednesday then the roller coaster goes back down as we head toward the upcoming weekend we apologize for the phone problems here uh, but thank you all weather watchers who did uh, email us your attempts and please do so uh, until we get the phones back up and running here. Temperatures in the mid to upper 50s, except 50 for Becky out there in French Creek. And uh, we have uh, 57 in, North, in Youngsville, 54 in North Warren. We'll fix those. And out in Meadville, we have 52 degrees. So you can see uh, the lake effect clouds still coming into the region, uh, popping up here and there. And uh, they'll probably be with us to a greater or lesser extent through the afternoon. Gradual thinning out to some extent, uh, but we'll call it partly cloudy overall. All as a trough moves off toward uh, the south. Now we're finding uh, the lake effect clouds uh, still going on here off of Lake Huron. They've been stubborn. And uh, I think uh, things, again, with this high pressure is too far away to really cause a lot of stability. Uh, but overall, still a decent afternoon. Uh, the rain pretty much done, I believe, for uh, at least this time period. High pressure will gradually build in uh, through tonight and tomorrow. Southwesterly winds, nice return flow. Uh, temperatures will get uh, about normal for tomorrow. And we'll continue to warm up even into Wednesday as a ridge continues to build in to the area. No chance of rain. Two great looking days. Do some outdoor activities. Maybe clean up the yard. Uh, a couple of good days with that. This next front does arrive though and passes through on Tuesday around midday. Ushering in another round of much colder air that will stick with us not only Friday, but that trend will continue into the weekend with more lake effect showers, kind of like what we had last weekend. So enjoy the next couple of days, including this afternoon. Yeah, brisk winds, but should stay dry here along the lakeshore. Highs uh, 60 or perhaps lower 60s. Mix of sun and clouds on the inland side. Upper 50s to near 60 for your highs. And in the Chautauqua, the Gainey area, partly cloudy and your highs in the upper 50s. For tonight, <clears throat> fair skies. Winds die down. Mid to upper 30s, most areas, but with a light flow off the lake, we'll keep it in the area is close to the 50 here along the lake shore. Sunshine for tomorrow, noticeably milder. Highs in the middle, maybe even upper 60s, and we should get close to 70 as we head toward Wednesday with that sunshine. Showers come in on Thursday, 65. That could be a midday high. Temperatures will then start to fall. Look at that lower to mid 50s Friday into the weekend. Good chance to see some showers, particularly Friday and Saturday. And you can get changes to that forecast anytime.